if gardening truly is that simple, then we are very, very fussy about gardening. We may be overdoing it. We may be over controlling. We may be over fertilizing. We may be over spraying. We may be doing all those things wrong because we are disrespecting the built-in energy that is inside these, um, these life forms that were here first. Yeah, I want to make gardeners aware that um, gardening has gone through a little bit of a, a negative change. And I think the relationship between gardeners and their plants has actually changed. And I think what's happened is we've created this dependency. So our plants have never been as dependent on us as gardeners as they are right now in this moment of time. I think it is the, this idea of human nature to control everything that has caused this dependency. And uh, if this dependency continues, you know, it's going to be very, very different. You know, plants are going to need to be genetically modified. They need to be sprayed chemically to keep, to keep on going. This balance of allowing nature to unfold in such a way that they can go from germinating and producing seeds. That whole process has been, has been influenced by humans way too much. And if it doesn't stop, then it's going to be very, very hard on us to, uh, to keep food production going, to have these plants German uh, create seeds. It's going to be a very, very slippery slope. I remember my grandfather's garden. It was incredible. Like I, it, for me to create a garden like that, I have to work incredibly hard. And even then it's impossible almost because his starting materials were much better. And the output was very different. Uh, it was very, um, very natural and very strong. So this idea of gardeners stepping back, letting this pre-programmed energy that seeds have take, take charge, letting them do the work and us just being the uh, hand holder, the uh, waterer, just basically allowing our plants to, to go to where they need to go to uh, fulfill their requirements. You got to remember, we have this desire, what we want our garden to do. And that's not always the best way to achieve the goals that we want. The plants want to go from seedling to flower to seed. And that's all we need to respect. And that's all we need to understand is that they are pre-programmed to go through this massive transition to be able to produce seeds again to keep this cycle going. If gardening truly is that simple, then we are very, very fussy about gardening. We may be overdoing it. We may be over controlling. We may be over fertilizing. We may be over spraying. We may be doing all those things wrong because we are disrespecting the built-in energy that is inside these life forms that were here first. They provide us with oxygen. They, they do all these things for us. They feed us. They convert uh, CO2 into oxygen. 
they're very, very, um, very purposeful life forms. And if we don't respect them and, and, and nurture them in a way that they can do their job, we're going to be in a, a lot of trouble in the future. It's going to be a very artificial plant world. And that artificial plant world, again, means controlling nature. And nature does not need to be controlled. It has all the energy it needs to keep this connectivity working and alive.